The last time we caught up with Godolphin Lifetime Care was in 2018 at Horse of the Year show with Hero Worship. Um, and since then, he's been really successful. He went to Hoy's the year after as well and missed it, obviously because of COVID. And uh, life changed for us a bit as well with welcoming a baby, which you could probably hear in the background. Um, and we did go back to Hoy's in 2021 and Hero was the uh, reserve champion in the racehorse to riding horse class. Um, he's just been awesome. Yeah, just uh, he's the horse of a lifetime um, and I couldn't, can't thank uh, Godolphin enough for letting me have this, that special boy, which I got, gosh, almost 15 years now. Um, and he's enjoying a much quieter uh, way of life, having a, a chilled out time, nothing left to prove. And as you can see, we've welcomed a new addition to the, to the group. This is African Jazz. He's eight, an eight year old. Um, and again, I got him through the Godolphin Lifetime of Care rehoming scheme uh, back in October last year. Um, fortunate enough that he's had an amazing retraining already. So uh, we have been out enjoying a bit of eventing. Uh, Jazz has been showing me the ropes. We've been out, done a bit of show, done a couple of novice classes and he's just been awesome. Uh, he was second in his first one and went reserve champion at Hearts County show and then took him to Norfolk because it's just down the road. And he won his novice class and uh, was reserve champion again there. So. We have got lots of a really exciting future ahead of us. Um, going to Burley to have a go at the racehorse to riding horse uh, hoist qualifier there and really aim to hit the scene next year properly with some showing and, and aim to, for Aintree in the novice um, and uh, aim for Hickstead as well and carry on eventing. I'd really love to be brave enough to aim for the uh, uh, badminton grassroots. So 80s this year and then uh, I'm going to get older and braver <laughs> and uh, head for the 90s next year with that as the aim. Life has changed for me since uh, having Hero. Um, and we welcomed a baby boy in 2020 who is now uh, a feral two and a half year old. But both Hero and Jazz are just absolutely amazing with him. You know, I can, I could trust him to lead Jazz around. I can trust him to give him kisses. I can trust him to like feed them and know that they're not going to nip his fingers or anything like that. They really are just gentle giants and uh, they are hugely intelligent, I think. It just amazes me, you know, you could get a thoroughbred who was raced to go and won races, many races, uh, to go and win a dressage competition or an eventing competition, you know, but you couldn't get warm blood to go and win a race. So I think that just sums up how versatile and awesome creatures they are. You're a gorgeous boy, aren't you? Mm. So hard, big you. So hard. 